Let me ask a couple questions with this then as we go and start to interact with you on this. What kind of career do you want for yourself? And let me ask you this question. This is where I really am looking for some feedback. If you thought about a stellar career at the end of it, whenever, whenever you think you're going to retire, 65, we'll put that out there as the placeholder, and you say at the end of your career you had an incredible career, give me one aspect of what makes it an incredible career for you. One aspect that would be evidence that you had an incredible career. No right or wrong answer, this is you personally, but give me one thought about that, because I want to get a few of these out on the table as we talk about this. Lasting relationships. Lasting relationships. Thanks, Travis. Place it, Frank? Doing something uh, that I'm really passionate about that other people can, can see. Okay, something that, in, in other words, it would be tough to finish your career at 65 and say, you know what, I can tolerate most of that. But it wasn't something that's in your area of passion. How sad that would be. You'd have to go do the math. Not a math guy, I said that yesterday. But you'd have to do the math of how many hours you've spent in a career that you weren't passionate about. It'd be really hard for me personally to think I had a stellar career if it wasn't something I was really passionate about. So two aspects have come out, evidences, lasting relationships, I'm going to stress that a bit, Travis, some people I truly enjoy that have become my lifelong friends, and I was doing stuff I was absolutely passionate about, people could feel the passion, please, Kristen. Uh, people you don't know, know you and respect you. Yeah, I've earned the respect of those that I've come in contact with. What I like to think about that particular statement is I've become a professional and people can say there's the, and the word I always like to use that I, that I read in David Mason, there's the consummate profession. <laughs> and people had a respect. That would be part of it. What else? Please, Richard. I passed on what I know. I passed on what I know. I made a difference where I was. I helped somebody else along the way. By the way, in our profession, Here's, be mindful of this. Partners move towards retirement in our profession, profession, and everybody looks at transferring clients. There's very few firms that are attentive to transferring knowledge. So partners transfer clients and walk out the door with a lifetime of experience and knowledge in their head of how to do things, how to handle situations without any of it written down. Shame on us. Shame on us that somebody would, would spend a lifelong career gaining knowledge and only pass off clients when they're done and walk out the door. Some firms are smarter than that to deal with the transfer of knowledge and to make it happen, and it doesn't happen in the last month of their career. Melissa, what else? I was going to say something similar, just coaching others that I work with to be successful. I made a difference in the lives of others and their career. Our life is better because I helped them. And I had an interest in them, a sincere interest in helping them. What else would make part of a stellar career for you? Other things. Place them. No personal financial worries. Yeah, I mean, there's a difference between saying I want to be filthy rich and I want to be financially secure. I mean, the idea that all these other things would be there, but I was worried when I finished my career of how to help my kids through college or make the house payment or whatever. I had a hard time thinking through that and thinking, well, that was stellar, except I can't pay my bills. So I like the idea that one aspect of it would be financial security that comes with it, where I can afford to do things I would like to do, and especially now that I now have more time with family or friends, that I have the ability to go do some nice things with them and not worry about how I'm going to do 